Has the ACT science test changed recently? Unfortunately, the answer is yes, even though you probably haven't heard anything about it, because apparently the ACT likes to make big changes to its important test without making any big announcement or press release. It seems that the changes to the ACT science test format have crept in slowly over the past few years, and it seems that now all of the science tests will probably have the same new format, even though we can't be sure of this since the ACT hasn't officially said anything about this. Here's what the old format of the ACT science test looked like. There were three data representation passages of five questions each, three research summary passages of six questions each, and one conflicting viewpoints passage of seven questions. And here's what the new format of the ACT science test looks like. There are now two data representation passages of six questions each from five, three research summary passages of seven questions each from six, and one conflicting viewpoints passage of seven questions. Now at first you might be thinking that's a good change, right? There are now fewer passages, which means that the science test is going to be crazy less fast. Well, the news actually is not that good. Even though there are fewer passages, two more things have also changed. First, there are now significantly more questions that require you to know specific science content knowledge. So, you need to come in with more prior knowledge about science than you did before. And second, there are now fewer questions that you can find the answer to really quickly just by glancing at a chart. More of the questions now require you to actually understand the context of the passage, which means they'll take longer to solve. And because of all of these things, it seems that students have generally been getting lower scores on the ACT science test. That being said, there are still great strategies that you can use to give yourself a huge advantage on the ACT science test. I'll be coming out soon with new videos about the best ways to manage time for the new ACT science format, as well as more videos, so make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for these latest updates. Well, that's all for now. I'll see you next time.